All right, guys, welcome back. I'm Mel7. This is Football Manager 2018, the beta early access. We're going to take a look at another match today. We will see, well, it's not going well. Let's just, let's just call it that way. Let's take a quick look at our schedule and see we did actually win a game. Finally, finally, we beat Mansfield, kind of. Penalty kicks at the end, but we won it, damn it. We won it. So we'll take it. Uh, we went on to pay Port Vale. I thought we were going to win. You can see Campbell. We swapped him in at halftime. Actually, we went with a different formation this this match because uh, we didn't we we didn't have any wingers. I mean that that's essentially it. Uh, due to injury, international play, and such, we had nobody else to play on the wing. So uh, we went with a four three three narrow type. We'll look at it in just a second. Um, and we played very well. We dominated possession. Uh, we led in shots. Um, you know, we we looked like a, the better team. They came in at the 86th minute with a with a shot and managed to tie it back up. So I was a little bit disappointed, but overall I was pretty happy with the formation of how we did. And like I say, Campbell finally got his shot. So we're gonna go on to more combe here. Um, probably a little bit early to do another match, but they're in 21st place. There's not a lot of teams we're picked to win. Um, we are kind of picked to win this one. However, if we check the inbox, you will see that um, um. Knott's County man Tommy Johnson has said that if I lose this one, uh, my position would be untenable. Copper is dying over here. She, uh, it's dinner time. There she is. And she just wants me, well, it's not quite dinner time, but it's, it's close enough for her. <laughs> and she's dying, poor puppy dog. She's going to have to wait till after this video, though, which will be about dinner time when, when we're done. Anyway, so so Tommy Johnson uh, says my position is just about up if I lose this. So, of course, we followed that up with another injury. We had a pre-match meeting where I said we were going to use the new formation, and everybody said, screw you. We're not a, we don't know that position. It's the only formation. It's the only thing we've done well in, but that's okay. We don't want to do it, so um, yeah. Oh, we lost Nathan Phillips in the last game as well, so he's injured as well. So let's see what we can do here. Um, I don't know. I guess we bring back Duffy. Put him in. Um, this is the formation. We've got Alessandra up here as our attacking uh, midfielder. We're going to use him as a shadow striker, although it hasn't really worked very well. Um, I think what I'm going to do actually is I'm going to put Grant up there and then we'll swap somebody out here. No, I didn't click his name. I clicked the arrow. Um, Michael O'Connor still out for another, you know, 87 years. Um, we'll put Liam Walker in. He actually, I forgot he does play well there. Uh, he was act. we've been running him on the wing, but he does play well here as well. He was on international duty. He didn't play particularly well, but... We'll bring him back, drop him in there. I think that will be fine. We'll run Grant here. Um, and um, um, we need some attack up there. Does he have any sort of shot? I couldn't tell you that at this point. Let's see. Well, um, let's take a look. Finishing of 10. Not really. Not really. So we probably, we definitely don't want him as a shadow striker. Let's just put him as a advanced playmaker on support. We don't really have anybody up there on attack. Um, we probably should. I'm going to go ahead and throw Campbell back in there. And we'll go ahead and put him back up as a poacher. Well... You know what, no, because he isn't really capable of creating. He's capable of scoring but not creating himself. So we're making Poacher. We're going to leave Steed as our target man on support. Uh, we'll put Grant up there. We've got Liam Walker. We've got Milsom and Yates back here. Uh, is that who we want back there? I don't think it is. I think we've got Thompson. One of these guys actually does play really well. There we go. Ball-winning midfielder. Oh, we're going to leave him on support. So I think that's what we're going to run with this time. We'll see how it goes. 
So we're starting standard mentality, flexible shape, no extra special rules or anything going on. Um, let's hit continue. The match is tomorrow. Auto save. We'll see how that goes. Try to, there we go. Lock my chair in there so hopefully I don't drift out a screen here. Feels like my chair has sunk down too. I think I was I was higher up a second ago. Let me let me fix that while we're talking about it. Yes, it did. Okay, there we go. That looks more like how I originally framed that camera. Fitness test. Let's take a look. Richard Duffy passed his fitness test. He is good for 75 minutes, which is good because I think we're starting him. Jonathan Forte is out. Let's make let's check what we got going on here again. Um Donald, Daniel Jones can come back in for Dickinson. Let's do that. Let's let's start with that right there. Um, maybe. Does he want to be a... If we do that, we're really, really narrow. No, I think we got... I think we do wing back support... Wing back support. So we run those guys out there to give us a little bit more width and, and support there. Let's go ahead and save that sucker with that setup for the moment because I do like that better. Um, Duffy's really only supposed to play 75 minutes. We could put Hollis or Hunt in. I think I'm going to put Hunt in for Tootle. And then if somebody gets injured or there's an issue, we can. But we're going to start Duffy, and then we'll we'll try to remember to swap him out before he dies. And I think that's it. I think that's what we're going with. And I am recording. I, I had, a, had a panic attack there. Let's hit continue. Match preview. Uh, he's given out two yellow cards a match, about half a red card a match. Team selection. Submit team. Let's see how this goes. I do really like this page here. Oh, big eyes. I brain tries to get enough oxygen to prepare for this. Let the assistant do it. A few players liked it. Kick off. Play. We don't need to see people walking out. All right. Ah. Uh. Not narrating this one, so of course maybe it'll turn into a scoring chance. Oh, up to Campbell. Oh my god, it It actually did. <laughs> Campbell's speed actually helped us out there. Led to a corner kick. Right off the kickoff. Imagine that. Walker feeds it in, tries far post, up to Duffy. Thompson. Oh my god, there was a rocket near side. And uh we're up one nothing, fifty-eight seconds in. That's not going to last. That is, that is not going to last. Let's see the replay here. Walker feeds it in. Duffy puts a head on it. Thompson just slots it in. Need as you please. Beauty. Oh, my gosh. Is this the turnaround finally? I don't actually know how to say this visiting team. I would just say more can be, but uh, it's British, so English rules don't actually apply in any way, shape, or form to their place names. It's, it's probably something like Ainsley. Um, oh my gosh. Hard shot from outside. Rose just let it fly. Um, we look complacent. We've got a one nothing lead. <laughs> we haven't won a single match in league play all season, but we look complacent. Um, possession's okay, 52%. We are at standard at the moment. I think we'll just stick there. Um, our possessions, you know, right around 50%, so I think that's probably a good place. Rose has a corner kick here. Thompson got ahead on it, put it out. Walker manages to run it down. Gets it up to Steed. Steed going to get it up to Campbell. We've got Hewitt on the outside. Even though he's supposed to be playing uh, mid-center, he's still apparently playing out as a winger. That's okay. Gave us a little width there. Led to a corner kick. Let's see if we can get another goal off this. Walker is ready to feed it in. Sends it in. Steed has it. Milsom tried to settle it down. 
Oh, he just got destroyed in there in the center. That had to have been a penalty. But um, apparently it wasn't. Bro got away with that one. And we continue on. I, I don't have any faith in us hanging on to a one gold lead for, um, you know, for 89 minutes. I just don't. I just, oh, he falls down. Campbell's able to track it down, but he's in a bad position. He tries to feed it in. There's nobody there. I don't even know what he was aiming for. That was just a bad pass, I think. Because um, there were people in front of that group and people behind that group, but clearly nobody in that group. Maybe he expected somebody to break. I don't know. Um, we're still struggling with team cohesion. Um, we don't have any, despite the fact we've been training it pretty much the entire season. And in fact, we're training it for, uh, instead of our, um, instead of training our tactic, we're training it for that as well now. They just refuse to work together. Um, according to the whole team dynamic thing, you know, most of the team is in the same social group. They're all fairly good for that. It should be okay, but clearly there's either there's more to it or it just doesn't work. I'm leaning towards the latter. Um, but I, I don't know. I haven't looked to see exactly how many of these players were here last season, so it's entirely possible that they had a complete turnover to other players who aren't any good from last season. I, I don't know. Let's continue on. Um, disinterest in what you have to say. Uh, eh, we'll say keep it up. Make everybody happy. That's in, It is supposed to be a pep talk. Um, now, the question is, do we want to swap Duffy out right now? He's played okay. He does have an assist. Breezley's the one that's complacent. Um, I think we, I think we stick with him for now. Uh, you know, it's just we don't have a huge amount of depth back there. Supposedly he's safe for 75 minutes. We'll give him, you know, 75 minutes. We have had problems with injuries, uh, and we ended up having to use a bunch of substitutes in and. and at least one case not having a substitute because we used it um so let's we'll just kind of try to be safe I'm trying to play it a little too fine inside there and ends up losing it um we still do have the edge in possession 55 percent a huge edge in shots 11 to 2 um seven of which were on target that's really nice um and a little bit of an edge on fouls although we just narrowed that up five to four now so um not confident but happy with the way things have gone so far. Uh, Walker is really, really wiped out. We need to swap him out. Um, you know, he did have that international. Um, I don't know which one we go with. We'll go with Yates. No, we'll go with Alan Smith. He has better morale right now. Very good. He's happy. We'll throw him in there. We'll see what happens. Um, we're at 60 minutes so far. We'll go another 10 minutes, and then we'll uh, we'll swap out Duffy at 70. Oh, well, we didn't have 75 minutes. We had 60 minutes to do that sub, and now he's injured. So we'll go ahead and get him out. We'll put Hollis in. Confirm that. Hit play. There we go. Hopefully he'll be okay. Seems to be bouncing back, so just a minor little thing. 70 minutes. Uh, how about a quick uh, concentrate? Just to make sure we got people looking uninterested. Pindorsch comes way out for that free kick. Hewitt has it. Smith up to Milsom. Looks like we managed to get control of it here in the middle. We did. Oh, we booted way up to Steed to our target man, who tries to loop it over the head of the goalie and in and got very, very close. It was just a little bit too much mustard on that. Not quite able to drop it in behind. Goes off the post and out. Rose has a corner kick. And there we go. Told you we couldn't keep a one-goal lead. Come on. Yeah, yeah, we saw it. Let's go attacking. We only have one loss. You'd never know that. Um, but we just can't get a win. Just can't get a win. Rose has the free kick. He puts it in. Pindos comes out. 
Let's see if we can get anything going from this. Steed kicks it backwards to Smith, who is not looking for it. Up to Grant. Grant kind of sits on it for a little bit, tries to feed it up to Steed again. Somebody's standing two inches away, so Steed just kicks it off of him. Tries to get up and put a head on it. Doesn't happen. Jones goes back. Back over to Grant in the middle. Try to get to the other side. Breezley. Look, maybe you got it. Well, it says it's a goal, goal kick for uh, for Ainsley there. Morikambe, whatever it is. Um, so clearly it wasn't deflected. I thought it was initially, but... And that's it. Um... This looks like it'll be the final play, maybe. Uh, we just headed it down to absolutely nobody for no reason, and now Thompson has it, so maybe we'll lose this one. Uh, Thompson manages to put that one wide. And that is match. We managed to lose our one-goal lead and have yet another dry dis draw, despite 20 shots out of over five, nine of which were on target. Um, fewer fouls. We played great. We just didn't win. So I think probably um, we didn't win because they got complacent and lazy at the end. But I'm going to say I'm going to say there were positives. And there were. We did play pretty well. We just we can't score. And that's partly because our, our strikers either have a little bit of speed but no ability or they're uh, in a wheelchair. One of the two. Um, Actually, wheelchairs are probably faster than some of our players. We've got the walkers without the tennis ball on the bottom, so we keep getting stuck in the grass. That's, I think, think that's the way it's going at the moment. Um, this needs to be fixed, whatever this mess is there. Um, it either holds up or it, stuff moves but nothing happens, or stuff seems to be happening but nothing moves days or three weeks out. Um, I don't know. I hope they fix that. Anyway. That's our episode. I thought we were going to have a win for you there um, against Morikambe. I mean, there are teams that have done worse, although Port Vale did beat us. Or draw? Maybe that was a draw. So, six games in, we still have no wins. Is what it is. Anyway, I'm Mellow7. This may be the last time you see me before I get, before I get fired. <laughs> Duffy injured. Nope, he's out two to three weeks. Injuries continue to decimate the two or three players we have, even the ones I hate. Thompson shines. Uh, yeah, he did play well. Knott's County looking for a win. Should we tell him he did well? Um, five tackles. He's played well as a defensive midfielder, and the one goal, I don't, this is, this is going to get us in trouble here. Um, I think we'll tell him his defensive work was good. Ah, and we didn't get in trouble. Yes! Anyway, we'll see you guys next time. Cheers.